Now we're gonna work around here. Okay, then we're gonna see you later again. Yeah, that's very now this is Reno, and Reno here is a rhinoceros hornbill. Now Reno was actually donated to the bird park when he was a very, very young bird. And we estimate that he's just about 3 to 4 years of age right now. Now the rhinoceros hornbill is in the air. Now let's see if Reno can catch it for us. Alright, here it comes. Very nicely done. Rhinoceros hornbill is so named because of their very huge um, Pass, which resembles the horn of a rhinoceros. Okay, tell you what, Gerino, he has done a very good job and it's time for him to head on home. And I believe one of our trainers is coming up, that would be Latin, and off he goes, right over there. Oh, okay, he's decided to fly over there to look at a baby who has just come in. And all the way back, oh, thank you very much, Gerino. Those birds, they're spinning all around and yes, well done, very good, thank you very much, all six volunteers. You have been very Yes, I see them coming. Yo, look at them. Okay, now this is Ernest and that is Ernie over there. Now these two are emus. Now emus are native birds to Australia. Now they are the second largest birds in the world, second in size only to the ostrich. Now they can grow up to a height of about 1.9 meters tall and weigh up to 50 kilograms. Okay, now the noisy bird is coming by. Okay, now like I was saying, um, they can weigh up to a height of about 3, they can grow up to a height of about 1.9 meters tall and weigh up to 50 kilograms. Now, unlike ostriches, this that has very big and fluffy wings, the ostrich, the emus, has wings that are only about this size, so naturally they cannot run at, uh, cannot fly at all. But they can run very fast, up to a top speed of 55 kilometers an hour. And right now we're gonna get them to run back and uh, Lucky coming out to help me hurt them back. Look at him go, whoa, those long legs. Uh, yeah, yours too, uh, Lucky, you have pretty long legs to end up. They go, very good. Thank you very much, Lucky. Okay, not to worry. Now, I will spend most of the time out during the night hunting. Now, they depend very much on their fignon, or rather, their keen sense of hearing when they hunt. Now, right now, we're going to simulate a hunting expedition for you, okay? And then, what I have here is the mouse back from him. As you can see, he's very possessive here. Okay, very good. Well done, buddy. All right, let me come right up here to me again. Very good, let me go with 
Ja, das ist auch sehr gut.
Thank you.